And hello, everyone, and welcome to this uh, Make Code from Microbit uh, show. And today we're going to be learning how to code the Microbit, super cool microcontroller. And we're going to learn um, today about the temperature sensor. So if you have a Microbit and you look at the back, you'll see that um, there's a temperature sensor. It's uh, There's a little marking there, and we can measure. So what we measure is a combination of um, the ambient temperature and it's very cool you can actually uh, measure different parts of your house and figure out where it's cold and where it's hot and we're gonna learn how to do that in the make code editor all right so if you're in your browser you can go to makecode.microbit.org and you can uh, follow the lesson along all right so in make code what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in input which is where all the sensors are. And under input, you will see, and then we have our assistant that's just arrived. Hello, assistant. Hi, Daddy. All right. All right, well, I'm gonna continue while the assistant is, is getting settled. Uh, so we're talking about temperature and whenever you think about an input or a sensor, uh, you're going to want to go into the um, input area and uh, sure enough, there is a temperature block. Now you can see that uh, it's a round block because it, um, it returns a value. It returns temperature in degrees Celsius. So we're going to go and uh, store that in variable and call that temp. So I'm going to create a variable and restore that. I'm going to assign that to my, to my temperature. And we have your assistant. Oh, we can't get things going on with my cables. Oh, I'm high. All right. Yeah. There we go. All right, so Zili, we're gonna first uh, show uh, the temperature number on the screen. So you wanna go in basic Base. and find show number. Show number. That's gonna be the first block in the list. <laughs> show number. And we're gonna put that in the forever loop. In forever. Right under it. There we go. And now we're gonna go in variables. Variable. And we're going to grab the temp, the round variable. So we're going to read the value in the variable. And we're going to show it in the screen. Now, take a look at the simulator. And you can see that the simulator... And somebody has unplugged my, my mouse. All right, mouse is back. Uh, in the simulator, you can actually... I'm, I'm going to do it, silly. You can play with the temperature. So you can simulate... It's kind of hard to find. Um, I wouldn't recommend frying your microbit. It's probably easier to find a place that's cold. But if I change it to, let's say, 6, eventually it's going to say 6, and I can start changing the numbers. So you can do all the testing of your code in the, in the simulator. Now, what we're going to do, uh, Zili, is we're going to transfer this, uh, this code to the physical microbit. Okay, so All right, download. can you start doing a download? So we're going to do the download here. Oh, and I'm connected with WebUSB. So the download is instantaneous. And what you can see here is that... It doesn't download. It's... Uh, Not downloading. Yeah, it is downloaded. And it is, what, 24 degrees? And if I plug in... Oh, you look hot, Daddy. If I plug in this... You look hot. Now I'm on battery. So I'm on battery here. And I could walk around the house and collect uh, data about where it's hot or not. All right. So that's, um, that's one way to do it. But we're going to do something more exciting. We're going to do... Wait a second, let me find the right view here. We're gonna do radio. So, let's assume we have two microbits here. Uh, hold on. 
and this temperature, this micro bit here is going to be doing the, is going to be uh, the sensor for the, how hot it is. So it's going to tell us maybe 10 degrees Celsius. And it's going to send this temperature to the other micro bit. And then your micro bit is going to do, you know, it's going to show five on the screen. All right, so we're going to do a show string here. Now, the fun thing we can do is we can go and put this one into, uh, into a fridge and we can see how how cold this this gets um, so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna program this one to transmit the the temperature put it in a fridge and see um with the other microbit what's going on sounds like a plan Zilli? Mm -hmm. so what's the coding all right so the coding is the coding is going to be we're going to go in radio we're going to go in radio and we're going to get the send number. And we're going to put it right under temp. There you go. Now, instead of doing a show number, we're actually going to send that temperature over the radio. So we're going to uh, grab the temp, this this variable, the red one. We're going to grab the, the variable. The, we're going to grab the variable here mm -hmm. and we're going to move it here. All right. Now we're not going to show the number that we have locally. What we're going to do is we're going to go in radio, go in radio. again, and we're going to get on receive number. So we're going to handle the fact that we just received the number from the other micro bit, and you can just put it there. Yep. Why is there this? And then we're going to do show number in there. And now what you're going to do is you're going to grab the number you received from the other micro bit and put it in show number. Now look at the simulators. They're both 21. Now what if I change this one to 6? And what you're going to see is that hmm something something is going on here. Let's see. We're going to we're going to use uh let's let's set a group. Um Oh yeah, there no, there we go. Okay, hold on a second, Zilli. So we have here, the micro bit here is receiving the temperature from this one, 21. And this one is sending the temperature to the other one. So we have now uh, a great little um, sender receiver project. I'm going to set the group so that they talk to each other. And we're going we're gonna to download that into our micro bit. Okay, download. Yeah, let's do a download. Um, right click. I downloaded. Yeah, you want to do the right click. Uh, yeah, it wasn't connected. So we're going to do it again. It's downloading. Mm. It's done downloading. It doesn't show anything, which, which is not really helpful because there's not a second one. I'm going to add a little. Can I? Can I? And let's download again. Oh, you want to change the icon? I'm gonna put a checkerboard. All right, checkerboard looks good. Always. Because there's always a cool checkerboard. All right, and back to downloading. Hit download. And Web USB is very fast. We'll we'll show how you can get that going. So, yep, it's working. We've got one micro bit here. Can I just say? And we're gonna take another micro bit. Daddy. And we're going to. Download again. In this Maybe one. we could say start so it knows when it starts. Hold on. Download again. Okay. Download. Yeah, right click. Download. Saving uh, as. Yes. Um, and save to the micro bit. All right. So we're going to have these two micro bits talk to each other. Let's see how that looks. They're both 21. Can I? So we've got. This Can one I? and this one. And now they're starting to show the temperature. Kay. Now, Zili, what? you're going to take this one mm -hmm. and you're going to put it in the freezer. Okay. All right, so the freezer is quite far. 
Oh, so I think we're gonna lose the signal. Well, we know. Can I, can I just put it in the downstairs freezer? Yeah, downstairs freezer. So when we don't see the number anymore, uh, well, this means we lost the signal. And probably because it's in a metal case, it's, it's really not gonna help. Is it in the freezer? Yeah. The All right, see, everything goes well. Um, we should see a number go down. And yeah, so unfortunately, we lost the signal. So Zilly, can you, can you go and get it back? Can I, do I have to put on the top freezer? No, just bring it back. Okay. Now let's try that. So it's not receiving any packet right now, so it's not showing anything. But as soon as it's going to become back, be back in range, and now it's 22 degrees, right? So it, it went down three degrees from, or two I degrees from 22, 24. I saw the 20, 20, 26. Right. So this is, uh, and this is the... This is the one that just came back from being frozen, so it's a bit colder. And we can see that on this other one who's listening for the signal. Okay, what do we do else? And that concludes this great little short story about mm -hmm. logging in temperature. In future movies, we'll Wait. see how we can use Web USB to do that in the browser. Wait. Can I put start? You want to put start? Put it here. Um, enter, enter. Enter, and then don't forget to download. Download. Right click. Save and as. <coughs> and it's downloading. So now it's going to say start. And then I'm going to have to put it back in the freezer. All right, run back to the freezer. Okay, then give me the charger. Here's the frozen, okay. the frozen microbit. Let's see if it. Leave it for a long time. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, I am gonna find another microbit, and we're gonna try to see the data in uh, the editor. Let's see. So I've connected another microbit here. I'll watch the microbit. And I'll try to pair it to that microbit. Okay. So I'm going to go click on pair device. And uh, basically, you will cover that in, in details in a movie. It's possible to connect your device to the computer. And yeah, this one hasn't been upgraded. Let's try another one. Okay, mine and is. We're gonna connect to this it's one. It's starting to freeze. I'm gonna download the code to it. Oh, we're gonna have to put that one also in the freezer. Now go back, go back and take the, the get the microbit. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in serial and I'm gonna write the the values. I'm gonna write the values that I'm getting here. I'm gonna go in serial. Here, serial, it's under advanced. And I'm gonna write this value here. I'm gonna say It says nothing. Temperature. It says nothing. Is this? It says nothing. Oh. Is it off? Oh yeah, it says nothing because uh, the other one is not transmitting. How much is it? Alright. Now, now what? what we're going to see, uh, I'm trying well, to find my view here. Well, All right, so my microbits are connected. But if you look at the editor here, hold on, Zinni. See, there's a show console device, and it's showing you the temperature um, live from this microbit. Now, Zilli, could you go and heat up the microbit between your hands, please? Yes, I apologize. So you're going to hold the microbit with the battery and put it in your hands under, under the camera. All right. 
Now look at the graph. So hold it. You, you want to put it, just grab the mic of it in your hand. Okay, hold it tight. You can also blow on it, and you'll see that we're going to want to blow exactly on the, let's see, can I grab it? And yeah, the temperature is going up. So what we're seeing here is uh, this microbit is um, getting is hotter. Is talking to this microbit. So this microbit is connected with the cable to the computer, and it makes it into the, here the chart. Uh, so you can actually have live data of your that of your sensor. Um, through the make code editor and that concludes this uh, amazing movie about collecting temperature with my assistant Zilly today -E -E uh, and we'll be back for more make sure to tune in this afternoon for uh, a big reveal of all I'm the features go. we have in beta oh. all right Zilly let's uh, stop the streaming bye